October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. While mammograms won't prevent cancer, they can be life-saving because they can catch it in its early, most treatable stages. When it's your time to get a mammo, you will want to head to Scottsdale Medical Imaging, a central place dedicated to women's imaging and breast health services. Getting a mammogram can make many women anxious. That's why the physicians and staff at Scottsdale Medical Imaging make the experience as comfortable as possible for their patients. What we do is we try and create a spa-like atmosphere at our facilities. We try and put the woman at ease from the minute she walks in. Our technologists are well-trained. They're very comforting and kind. The radiologists interpreting the exams are experts in breast imaging. And then as we talked about before, we have the same day answers program where you have the option of waiting and finding your results out before you leave so you don't have to go home and wait. Doctors here at Scottsdale Medical Imaging have guidelines for when a woman should get her mammogram. Well, for decades, the recommendation has been every year beginning at age 40. Now, there's some confusion because a few years ago, a, a study came out based on a national task force that recommended perhaps every other year beginning at age 50. But that was based on dollars, not based on saving lives. We recommend every year beginning at age 40. Now, there are some women who may need to start earlier than that based on high risk, and there's some women that may need additional imaging based on dense breasts, but that's another discussion. Every year beginning at age 40 is the recommendation. And people talk about your risk factor, and I think a lot of women get very confused. What does that mean? Well, it sounds intimidating, it sounds complicated, but in fact it's very easy. There are easily available calculators available on the web at cancer.gov and getamamo.com. Women can answer six or seven questions in a few minutes and it spits out their lifetime risk. An average woman's lifetime risk is 12%, that's that one in eight number they talk about. High risk is anything over 20%, moderate risk is in between. So a woman can get that number along with knowledge of dense breasts can tailor her approach to screening for breast cancer based on her individual needs. In some states there are new laws regarding breast density being passed. Scottsdale Medical Imaging lets their patients know about their breast density as well as the results of their labs. Breast density refers to the way your breast looks on a mammogram. So every woman's breast is composed of dense tissue and then they have fatty non-dense tissue and each woman has a different combination of the two. Um, as women age, their breasts tend to get less dense. The reason why density is important is it can sometimes make interpreting a mammogram more difficult. So dense tissue looks like white spots and a tumor can look like a white spot. So as you can see, it might be hard to see a tumor in dense tissue. Every state is doing it a little different. The underlying theme in, it, in the bills are that the women need to be notified that their breasts are dense, but they're not telling them exactly what they need to do if they do have dense breasts. So that's where it gets a little controversial and where women really need to talk to their doctors to find out what their risk is and whether they should get additional imaging. While routine mammograms are important, there isn't necessarily a one-size-fits-all approach. Once a woman knows her risk factors and individual density, Scottsdale Medical Imaging can help with the next steps. The reason why they suggest ultrasounds is that more cancers can be found on the ultrasound that weren't seen on the mammogram. But the problem is there are a lot of false alarms with the ultrasound. So it often leads to additional imaging studies and biopsies. Now for some women, the anxiety associated with those additional tests is worth it in order to have peace of mind at the end. For other women, they prefer not to have these additional tests. For more information on Scottsdale Medical Imaging, please go to their website, getamammo.com, or you can call this number you see right there on your screen.